Aurora's Underfoot, presented by Science at NASA. Glowing green and red, shimmering hypnotically across the night sky, the Aurora Borealis is a wonder to behold. Longtime skywatchers say it is the greatest show on Earth. It might be the greatest show in Earth orbit, too. Some 400 kilometers above our planet, astronauts on board the International Space Station enjoy a unique view of Earth's polar lights, up close and personal. We can actually fly into the auroras, says astronaut Don Pettit, a flight engineer for ISS Expedition 30. It's like being shrunk down and put inside of a neon sign. Auroras are caused by solar activity. Gusts of solar wind and coronal mass ejections strike Earth's magnetic field, rattling our planet's protective shell of magnetism. This causes charged particles to rain down over the poles, lighting up the atmosphere where they hit. The physics is akin to what happens in the picture tube of a color TV. Incoming particles are guided by Earth's magnetic field to a pair of donut-shaped regions called auroral ovals. There's one around the North Pole and one around the South. Sometimes when solar activity is high, the ovals expand and the space station orbits right through them. That's exactly what happened in late January 2012, when a sequence of powerful solar flares sparked a light show that Pettit says he won't soon forget. The auroras could be seen as brightly as city lights on the Earth below, and even in the day-night terminator of the rising and setting sun. It was simply amazing. Pettit is a skilled astrophotographer. He and other members of the crew video recorded the displays, producing footage that officials say is some of the best ever taken from Earth orbit. <laughs>